Egypt, following the decisions of the United Nations, Israeli troops with their vehicles, heavy guns and mortars continued their withdrawal from the Sinai Desert at a distance roughly 30 miles from the Canal Zone. The plans for this operation had been discussed at the coast town of El Arish by General Burns, commander of the United Nations Emergency Force. Meanwhile, Yugoslav United Nations soldiers took over positions evacuated by the Israeli forces. Spreading out on a narrow line, they left a no-man's land between themselves and the Israelis. Back on the canal itself, where many wrecks blocked the waterway, a team of British naval frogmen did an invaluable job, surveying the hulls of submerged wrecks and passing their information to the salvage experts. German ships joined the Suez operations, already the biggest salvage fleet ever mustered, to help towards a speedier opening of this vital waterway. As the Allied withdrawal continues, over 1,200 officers and men embarked in the carrier Theseus en route for Malta. Here they'll transship for their journey to Britain. And General Sir Hugh Stockwell, Commander Allied Land Forces, came to say a personal thank you and to wish them bon voyage. Sailing away from the troubled Middle East, there's the joy of well-earned leave ahead among the folks at home. Thank you.